Hi, I'm Brad Petchel from Southern Mallee in Victoria um, at a little place called Hopeton. We have about 750 hectares of um, cropping ground that we grow uh, wheat, barley, uh, canola and hay. So we do vetch for hay and sometimes oat and hay. We run a Gason Scarry Till uh, direct drilling bar with a um, 12 tonne bin. It's on 12 inch spacings. One of the biggest issues faced with seeding is blockages. If you've got blockages, you've got weed issues. Um, you can also go half the day with um, seeding and then find that um, by the end of it, you've had half the bar that hasn't been sowing. So um, it, it can get expensive, um, just frustrating more than anything because you've got to go back and redo it at the end of the day. Look, yeah, every farmer has issues with blockages, whether they like it or not. Um, it can be from dirty seed or uh, even mud getting in the bottom of your tines. It's definitely just frustrating and it's always an expense, like there's fuel and sometimes the fertiliser's gone out and you've got to go redo everything again. Traditionally, the um, blockages in previous systems has been monitored by the whole head, so one head can have six or eight, ten down tubes on it. Uh, with the wireless blockage monitor from FarmScan, uh, we can actually monitor every tube uh, and get a full system running of it, uh, which is a lot more accurate and precise. The wireless blockage monitor from FarmScan comprises of uh, multiple ECUs on every delivery head. It has sensors on as many tubes as you want to do, so you can monitor every tube on every um, time, or you can do every second one if you want to. Um, and then that actually sends the message back to an iPad in the tractor. The system has on the, the actual iPad screen, it has a picture of your head. And when one of those goes off, you'll have an order or alarm that will actually alarm you to say that that head's blocked um, or what the single tube is actually blocked. And it will also detect flow rate and that of the, each individual head as well. So you can actually see when the head is starting to block up. So since we've had the system, uh, we now don't get faced with blocks because as soon as they are happening, we can actually see it on the screen. And at the end of the run, you can just hop out and unblock whatever the issue is. Um, it also saves downtime of when we actually fill the cedar. We normally used to go and check all the heads. Well, now we don't really have to do that now. It will tell us what one's blocked. Having the blockage monitor can um, virtually tell you when it is running out of seed. You'll get a flow rate on the screen, which will actually tell you a percentage. Um, and if you monitor that and have the alarm set for it, you can actually see when either this fertiliser or seed is actually running out. By having the system, it's definitely improved. Um, it's just a peace of mind. We know we go out there and the job's done right. You don't have blockages anymore because you've fixed them. It's definitely well worth it. The system is very reliable, just works every time you get into it. But the support for the system is very good. Um, local support is a very important thing to have um, and farm scanning themselves have been very good for backup support.